if I scroll down, uh, if I scroll down here, you're going to see all these wallets, okay, that are connected to my MetaMask, okay, and uh, with the permission I've given to all these uh, kind of um, contracts, some of them, if they are a dubious contract, they can they can be able to assess my MetaMask and they'll be able to steal any fund that I have in my MetaMask, okay, so for that reason, I I start using this particular uh, website to revoke any contract that I feel shouldn't have access to my MetaMask, okay? Yeah, so this uh, video is just purposely to show you how you can protect yourself uh, from scammers stealing your money from your MetaMask um, wallet, okay? Uh, for me personally, uh, my $430 US dollars was stolen from my MetaMask accounts because as I then I was not privy to this particular information, okay? So um, I had to go to a BSC scan and um, I did some findings and I discovered that the 430 US dollars that was stolen from my accounts was actually from a contract that I connected to my MetaMask account, okay? So in this video, I'm going to be showing you exactly how you can actually protect your fund in your MetaMask, how you can disapprove some um, permissions that you give to some contracts to your MetaMask wallet, okay? Um, if you go to MetaMask here, you discover that when you join some project, okay, you come to this three dots here, you click on this connected sites, okay? Um, you can see there are some sites that are connected to your MetaMask, okay? You give them that permission. Uh, by the time you were trying to connect to that DAP, okay? Uh, they ask for your MetaMask permission and you give that permission. So in this video, I'm going to be showing you how you can revoke uh, that permission that you actually give to them. If you disconnect from here, it's not even enough because if you disconnect from here, um, you'll be disconnected from the website, but they still have your permission, okay? They still have permission to your funds, to the funds in your website, okay? So I'm going to be showing you how you can actually disallow that permission, okay? Uh, now, there are three major, there are so many other um, uh, websites that you can actually use to do this revocation. But there are three major websites that you can use uh, to do this revocation. Uh, first among the list, um, one of them is actually called rockdoc.io, okay? You can come to rockdoc.io, come down here, click on these tools, you come to revoke permission here, okay? We get to revoke permission here, you paste uh, your wallet address. In it. So you can see um, the permission will be given to your MetaMask will be connected to rockdoc.io and um, you can check um, the approval of the contract down here, okay? Now, the second project that you can use to check um, that also is called um, revoke.cash, okay? Uh, this revoke.cash also, you can just click here. Now, when you click here, it's going to connect to your MetaMask. It's going to ask you to connect to MetaMask, okay? If you click on MetaMask, it's going to take you through the process on how you can actually revoke your contract also or revoke permission that you've given to any other website, okay? But the number one um, revoking uh, app or website that I use, that a whole lot of people use, that is very economical, is called app.onrect.net, okay? Remember, app.onrect.net. Now, I'm using this particular one because um, it's very, very, um, it's, it's the, 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 the gas fee when using uh, Onrect is very, very reasonable compared to other ones that I've actually used, okay? So um, wh what you're going to do is this, you're going to connect to this, okay? Where you, where you get to this website, app.onrect.net, you're going to come down here, you click connect wallet here, okay? Then you're going to click on MetaMask, okay? So after doing that, you can see automatically I'm connected. If I scroll down, uh, if I scroll down here, you're going to see all these wallets, okay? That are connected to my MetaMask, okay? And uh, with the permission I've given to all these uh, kind of um, contracts, some of them, if they are a dubious contract, they can they can be able to assess my MetaMask and they'll be able to steal any fund that I have in my MetaMask, okay? So for that reason, I, I start using this particular uh, website to revoke any contract that I feel shouldn't have access to my MetaMask, okay? So for the purpose of this uh, video, uh, we're going to be revoking this particular one here, okay? Let's revoke this one, this USTC. Pancake Swat Rope 2, okay? 
router two, we are going to revoke this particular one, okay? So what you're going to do is this, make sure you have at least some funds in your MetaMask, okay? Because you'll be paying gas fee for this. So what you're going to do is this, you're going to click on this revoke. Okay, so when you click on this revoke, it's going to take it to your MetaMask, okay? After connecting with the website, you're going to see uh, the fee you are to pay. You can see I'm paying just zero point zero six um dollar, okay, which is a very very small amount of money, okay. So take note of this particular one. After I, I I give this confirmation and I revoke it, we're going to refresh it and we're not going to see it here again. So I'm going to click on confirm. Okay, so after I click on confirm, I'm going to wait for the transaction to go through. As you can see here, you can see um. Is, is going through the process of revocation, okay? So um, after that, we're going to discover that this uh, USDC Pancake Router V2 will no longer be here. You can see it just give a thumbs up here, okay? This thumbs up means that um, the contract has been revoked. So let's, let's refresh, okay? Then we're going to scroll down. You can see that particular V2 is no longer here. That USDC, uh, V2 is no longer here, okay? So that is how simple it is for you to actually disconnect and revoke permission that you've given to any DeFi project, any coin or whichever project that you connected your MetaMask with, okay? So I want to believe you actually got value from this video, okay? Uh, if, you get, if you got value from this video, please do me well by giving the video a thumbs up and also remember to subscribe to my channel, okay? Uh, I want to appreciate you for taking your time to watch the video. Do take care of yourself and bye-bye.